What's going on, everyone? I'm Saint Villain. Welcome to Huni Pop. Yeah, it's a puzzle game. That's also oh, couldn't switch. Welcome to Huni Pop, a sim day puzzle game. Yeah. So it wouldn't let me start it in full screen, so I had to go windowed and then the full screen. All right. Anyway, Sunday night bar lounge. Hi there. Hi. Hello. Wow. Okay. Could I get you to maybe take it down a notch? <laughs> I'm right here. Uh. You're like really, really cute. I think I'm a. Uh. uh I know, right? It's crazy. <laughs> My name is Kiyu. Nice to meet you. Hi. Do you like the letter? That's a weird name. Can't remember my name. <laughs> that right. one. Right. We'll try that again later. Look, dude. Are you gonna be all right? Looks like you're having some trouble holding it together over there. Uh, no, I just, uh, I just, nah, I'm chill, I'm chill. <laughs> That's a fat load of shit, and you know it. <laughs> oh, shit. Yes. Yeah, I just, I should just go. Nah. Oh, it's just that. You should. Uh. Oh, is that obvious? See how uncomfortable you are right now from space. Hmm. Wait. You know what? This might actually work. Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh man, this is your lucky day, buddy. Listen, I gotta What's go. What's going on? But we'll meet again real soon. Trust me. Night. Okay, that's a weird uh, way to start the game. My bedroom. Oh, okay. <laughs> what? Hey, you. Rise and shine. We've got work to do. You're a fairy. I said get up. Uh, all right. All right. I'm up. Uh, five more minutes. No way, dude. No time to waste. Well, uh, get your cup, please. Get up. That's ah, one. Don't you recognize this adorable face? <laughs> It's Kiyu from the bar. What? Uh, but you had brown hair, also not wings. Clever disguise, right? I can change my hair any color I want. It's pretty sweet. If you can't tell by now, I'm a fairy. Well, a love fairy to be exact. Okay. Oh, well. Why did you just say so? Okay, but fairies aren't actually a thing. Question. What exactly is a love fairy? Uh, yeah. Good. I'm glad you asked. You see, as a love fairy, it's my job to help poor saps like you out with the ladies. Gee, thanks. It's just, mm, what I do. I don't like to brag, but I'll have you know I have a very impressive track record. All of my previous clients are basically walking babe magnets now. You, though. <clears throat> Let's just say you will be my greatest accomplishment. <laughs> Uh, what do you want to help me? What's in it for me? What's in it for you? Thanks, but no thanks. Now, I'm still having a hard time trying to accept the fairy thing. Just kind of crush. Nah, this one. Man, you and all the questions. Can't a fairy just help a brother out? We need to get started right away. Tell me, how many dates have you been on? Uh, you mean, I mean, you know, an amount? Define date. Oh my god, it's worse than I thought, isn't it? All right, uh, grab your shit. We're going on a date right now. Someone has to show you the ropes. I know a place nearby that's open pretty late. You'll love it. Or not, I don't care. Okay. From my bedroom, where are we going now? Outdoor lounge. All right, now we got to do a puzzle game. So right. This is the weird I'll try part. To make this quick. Okay, it's all weird. This is the date grid. These little pieces are called tokens. Gotcha. You earn affection by matching three or more of the circular tokens horizontally or vertically. For a successful date, you have to fill the affection meter before you run out of moves. Go ahead, give it a shot. Match those orange ones with the crescent shape in the middle of the grid. Gotcha. See? Easy! Each of the four types of affection tokens represents a particular trait. The orange ones represent romance, Blue is talent, green is flirtation, and red is sexuality. Pay attention to which trait your date prefers. It'll go a long way. Uh, of course, what, matching what? four or five tokens will get you even more affection. I'll show you. Match those four sexuality tokens in the bottom right of the grid. 
The red ones. How do I match them? Can I... Oh! Oh, you can just move it all along the grid. Okay. Sweet. Okay, what's next? <laughs> oh, Sweet. Right. Let me cover the other token types real quick. The pink hearts are passion tokens. Matching those will raise your date's passion level. The higher her passion level is, the more affection you'll earn. The gold bells are joy tokens. You'll get an extra move by matching those. Very useful. The broken heart tokens are bad news. Seriously, avoid matching those as okay. best you can. Gotcha. Finally, the teardrops are sentiment tokens. Matching those gives you, well, sentiment. You need sentiment in order to use date gifts. And seeing as how you don't have any date gifts, I'm guessing I need to explain that too. Here, I'll hook you, you up. You need with to one explain of everything. The house. Teddy bear. Like I said, you'll need sentiment to use it. Convert all broken hearts. So go hearts. ahead and match those three sentiment tokens in the leftmost column, the teardrops. These ones. Okay. Now go ahead <laughs> this and is give so that weird. date gift to me. Oh, uh, do I just give it to you? Cool, huh? There are like a ton of different date gifts that you can get too. They each have a unique effect on the date and can be extremely useful in combination. Oh, <laughs> and thanks to a little fairy magic, you'll never actually lose them. So you can use them on your next date too. <laughs> Is that cool or what? All right, all right, I've gone on long enough. I'll let you finish up the date so you can get the hang of it. Oh, and don't worry, I won't let you fail this one. I'm not that mean. Okay. Uh, so I need passion. The pink. The pink. <laughs> some of those. And some of this. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, it's a really weird idea on the puzzle game. I don't know how exciting that's going to be either. <laughs> like watching me do puzzle game. No. Ooh, yeah, I don't want to match those up. Um... Ooh, nope, nope. You can't touch that one. Passion! Plus one move, cool. See, I can't move that one down at all, because it's gonna do that and it's bad. Can I do that? Yes, it can. Ooh! Uh, so. <laughs> uh. This. Oh, here we go. That can... Yeah, affection. But I want to get the passion. Uh, what's the blue green? Let's match one of those if we can. We can't. I want to know what all these are. Sentiment. What's this shit again? Passion. Affection? What? This was... No idea. Oh, there's no, no point in trying to figure it out, pretty much. Uh, just match something up. Did we win? Cool. We got that was Mooney. Nice. Money. See, I knew you had it in ya. Very strange, very strange. So we had to go to the lounge just to have a date with her. Back to my bedroom, of course. Oh shit! It's morning already? We are way behind schedule. Okay, check it out. I have one last thing to give you, and this is important. Introducing the latest in Love Fairy technology, the Honey Bee 4.0. The Honey Bee is an essential lifeline for any player on the go. It automatically registers the info of new girls you meet and can even track their location. You can <laughs> what? organize your inventory, buy new You'd gifts, be a stalker. Your traits. It's awesome. Hey, you don't even have you to remember have their name. You don't have time to go over every feature, but you're a big boy. You can figure it out. To access the honeybee, all you have to do is right click at pretty much any time. Or okay. if you're weird, you can use that button at the top of the screen. <laughs> go ahead. Break that bad boy open. We're going to be weird. We're going to do this. Click. Uh, tissue box? Use for wiping your nose or cleaning up other... Yeah. Dirty magazines. Reading material that you only look at for the interesting articles. Alright, so we don't have anything. 
Oh, what's this? Oh, we can, can buy stuff. Baking utensils. As, that's just that. I can change my gender. Changing each girl's... Whoa, I can change my gender? Okay. And these are something else. What are these? Ah, okay, cool. Screw it. Okay, great. I think that's it for now. Let's get out there and talk to some broads. Or we could just no. Uh, hell yeah, let's that's do the shit. I like to hear. Now, if you want to meet a hot chick, you gotta go where the hot chicks are. The beach. I've done some scouting and I have a few ideas of where to start. It depends what type of girls you're into. We can check out Video the university, games. the mall, the gym, the park, or the nearby cafe. Fuck what the gym. <laughs> uh, cafes, okay. Hit, hit on girls at the campus? Yeah, I don't come to this university. I just come here to pick up chicks. Let's Good go. Let's do that, Earl. Couldn't have picked it better myself. All right, ready? Get your game face on. Ready. Oh. oh, Miss Yumi, I'm glad I ran into you. Have you had a chance to grade our exams yet? Uh, remind me what that was on again? You know, the conservation of whatever She does not look like a teacher oh, at all. Yeah, yeah. I think those are on my desk. Somewhere. Oh, okay. Do you know when you might be able to get them back to us? Later. Next week, probably. I'm sure you did fine, Tiffany. You think? I hope so. I don't know. I was having trouble with some. Are we just material. eavesdropping on these two people Do having you know a conversation? What we're going over next week. I'd like to try and get a head start this time. Such a nerd. Next week. She's I more relaxed. It's better. Actually, I have a I don't even know what I'm right teaching. Now. Fuck. Can we do this later, please? Yeah. Okay. Sorry to bother you, Miss Yumi. No, it's fine. I'll talk to you later. Whoa! Is this chick serious? That schoolgirl uniform is a little on the nose, don't you think? She's a little cute, bit. though. Blonde, too, so, uh, bonus points. <laughs> Oops, oh, I skipped shit. Oh, yeah, don't worry. They can't see your, see or hear me. It, I'm just figuring out of your imagination. <laughs> okay. Nah, I'm crazy real. I just hid myself from everyone so I can give you advice on the sidelines. This is your classic girl next door situation. She's nice, so don't say anything to scare her off. But don't be afraid to take a chance. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> would it be too forward? To, uh, yeah, I would probably. Hey, don't take this the wrong way, but I thought, but I just thought you were too cute and I had this to hide. Uh, excuse me, do you know where I could find this student union? <laughs> I sure do. I know this place inside and out. Yeah, I gotta figure. Go past the building here and take a left at the fountain. You can't miss it. I haven't seen you around here before. Are you starting this semester? Yes, I'm a transfer student. I'm thinking about it. Would you recommend a school? I, I teach your uh, professor Hansen. No, but if all the girls are no, it's this one. Of course, this place is awesome. My professors are the best. You strike me as an athletic type. Uh. Sorry, I'm holding you up from getting to class. If I end up going here, you'll have to show me around. Yeah, I'd love that. It's really a beautiful campus, too. My name is Tiffany, by the way. It's nice to meet you. Hello, Tiffany. I don't have a name. You seem like a cool guy. Hopefully I'll I wonder see if you I actually campus. get to put a name or something. No. Wait! You did it! I'm awesome. Well, with my help, of course. I gotta admit, yeah, I you gave me three choices to pick from. That off. That's pretty easy. Beginner's luck. Don't let it go to your head. By the way, that other chick that was here just a second ago, since she was in range, the honeybee started tracking her location too. So after you're done here with this girl, you can go catch up with her too. Sounds just bust great. Bust out the honeybee and check out the girl finder screen. I'm pumped. You pumped? Yeah, you're pumped. Go get him. I'll be around <laughs> if you need me. <laughs> What am I saying? Of course you need me. Alright. So. <clears throat> so, what? Got a new mystery teacher. Talk with her. I get. Talking with her, I get money. Girl finder, check profile. Um. Let's just talk with her. No, fuck it. Um. Before I forget, uh, the Mooney you earned during our date. 
You can use that to buy gifts, food, and drinks using the store app on the Honeybee. It'll even detect which girl, which, uh, which gifts the girl you're talking to prefers and will mark them with an icon. We've practically done all the work for you. Okay, cool. Uh, girl finder. Shit, is it that time already? Oops. Yeah, you gotta go to class. Bye. I gotta go hit on more girls. Aiko. Oh, hey, Belly. What's wrong? Seems like something's bothering you. Yeah, life. <laughs> How are classes going? Uh, I don't want to talk about that. Mm, well, I think I have just the thing. I'm headed to the beach to work in a few poses. You should join me. Yes. Nothing like a little exercise to melt that stress away. Uh, not today. I'm just not feeling it. Will I at least be seeing you this weekend at the studio? I'll be there. I don't think I have anything else going on for once. Great! Can't wait. See you there. Dude. Bro. Asian chicks? <laughs> don't even get me started. I have like the worst case of yellow fever ever. Oh my god. Ever. Like a yellow plague. This is a tough approach. She's kind of in a shitty mood, so say something stupid to try and cheer her up. It doesn't matter what. The stupider, the better. I'm good at that. Can you teach me karate? Fuck these birds, am I right? Isn't it funny how life is pointless and nothing matters? <laughs> I ask myself the same thing all the time. Oh, uh, no, I just like to bother people who look like they want to be left alone. I'm only kidding, I just thought you were cute and I wanted to meet you. Ha, uh, but for real, what's up? You look a little bummed over here. Oh no, I'm good. I'm just trying to relax. Enjoy a little downtime between classes. I teach up at UOG. You know the place? It's like the only university in the city for some reason. A teacher you must be, like, really smart. Ah, uh, so you got that sexy teacher angle going then. Oh yeah, what do you teach? Oh yeah, eh, that one's kind of basic. Yeah, let's get the conversation well, going. I'm supposed to be a physics professor. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> yeah, physics sucks. I'm glad you came over here. I needed a good laugh. The kids call me Miss Yumi, but you can call me Aiko. Okay, Aiko. Um. Let's just go. Oh, let's meet. Uh, yep. Take care. This chick. <laughs> All right, cool. I met you. Bye. I'm gonna meet everybody first. Does that make sense? Gotta decide who I want to date. That's that's my thing. Options. Hey, serious? options right there. Oh come on, just try it on. It's going to look so cute. Try what on? There's nothing here. Come on. I saw it and I immediately thought of you. You're going to love it. I promise. Oh my. <sighs> All right, just. Make sure nobody else is around. Yeah, sure. The coast is clear. <laughs> You're good. Except for me peeking from the bushes. <laughs> Jess, oh. I can't wear this. What are you talking about? You look cute. Cute? Oh, stop. There's nothing wrong with a little skin. You can't keep all that boob to yourself, hun. It's not fair to the rest of the world. The world will be just fine without my boobs. Yeah, but I won't. Besides, oh. it wasn't cheap. So, you're stuck with it. So come on, let's go. I am not going anywhere in this. I'm changing back. Ugh, you are impossible. 